This is my Space 1999 stun gun. This was one of the most envied things when I was a kid. I wanted one of these more than anything I could imagine. I had a little toy that shot propellers, and it wasn't bad, but it wasn't quite the same. Uh, I recently bought a resin model, which is very nice, but I decided to build one with my own 3D printer, and here it is. It's one-to-one -one scale, it's printed in a silver, it's printed in green, red, blue, yellow, and black. Um, one of the things I wanted was realism. It's pretty good. The silver is a little dark. It's not too bad. I'm going to print a variation of white to see what happens, and I'll also probably buy some gray filament and see what gray looks like. One of the cool things is I altered the green stun at top. I mean, in, in the movies, I, or in the TV series, I believe it's a black um, sticker with the word stun in it. I wanted to do it in green just because green and red sort of mean safe and dangerous and I thought it would be a little bit better. Makes it my own variant. But what I really did with this model is kind of cool is I put rare earth magnets underneath the stun and the kill setting and in the switch itself so when you flip it, it really, it's solid. There's a rare earth magnet under kill, one under stun and they are attracted to the one in the switch and so when they when you move it from one position to the other, it really snaps into place. Got that idea from cell phones. Cell phones with flip screens uh, use the same thing with rare earth magnets. Um, not much more to say. It's nice. I was thinking I may add some weight to it by putting a, a hollow in here and in the handle to put a metal bolt in, but I'm not sure. We'll have to see about that. 